Hello, welcome to Cool Flood 101 Tutorials. Today we are going to be showing you how to download programs from Google, Chrome, Safari, or any internet browser. Today we will be downloading Scratch. This is already open, but we are going to find it again. So search Scratch dot download. Do not search on Scratch cupcakes. Click on Scratch online editor. And then you will click on your the first. You will normally click on the first on the first option for any program. No, we don't want online. You will be going to the number two option. Click on whatever type of operating system you have. We, Click download. In this case, we have Windows. This will take a minute. So we will pause the video. Now you are going to, you are either going to click on this. Or go to the downloads or folder. Or open the folder and go to your downloads folder, which is right over here. You click on that and you'll look for a scratch like that or a scratch installer. Do now you, ours is already open since we clicked. We will use the installer. We are going to use the installer right here. We'll double click on that and it will open mom in a moment. Then it will make you enter a password. I didn't hear that. Now, it, so a box will pop up like this. It may make you enter a password. We have just entered our password. Hit the next button, please. And it will say, the, and it will have a destination folder. You can change this where it is. We are going to keep it the same. Hit the next button. You can either rename it or keep it the same. We will keep In this it case, we will keep it the same. Hit the install button. And it will install all like of crazy. The, it will install all the programs and folders that you will need to use Scratch offline. You can use this anywhere, even when you're all done, even when you're offline. Sorry. Then you, after it says completed, you can hit next, and then it will say, it will say completing the Scratch setup wizard. Scratch has been installed on your computer. Click finish to close this computer. To close this wizard. Then, if you'd like to, if you'd like to put it in your taskbar, it may pop. It may, it will open. And, and if you'd like to, to put it in your task, it, if, if you'd like to put it in your taskbar, you can just drag the program. No, don't do that. That won't work. You have to double click on it or drag it. And if you are double clicking on it, you can right click onto it, and you can hit um, either. Since we already have it, unpin, you can right click and say pin the taskbar and it will pop up right on the bottom. And you can also hit pin to start menu. And we don't have, and we have Windows 8.1, though you can only have the start menu, menu on Windows 8.1. This has been another tutorial by CoolFlood101. Thank you.